hello everyone welcome to solve this nice math olympiad algebra problem so here we have 3 to the power of 5 minus 3 to the power of 4 equals to 2 to the power of m and here we solve this problem for the values of m so here the very first step we are going to do is here first we need to focus in the left hand side and now here we break the exponent of this uh, 3 to the power of 5 and we write it as 3 to the power of uh, 1 plus 4 minus 3 to the power of 4 equals to 2 to the power of m and after that here uh, we apply uh, the nice uh, exponential law and you know that if we have a to the power of m plus n equals to a to the power of m into a to the power of n so here we apply this nice exponential law uh, in this in the left hand side uh, so we break this exponent and we write it as 3 to the power of 1 multiplied by 3 to the power of 4 minus 3 to the power of 4 equals to 2 to the power of m and now you see here we have 3 to the power of 4 be the common term so that we take common 3 to the power of 4 and the remaining terms are 3 minus 1 equals to 2 to the power of m okay so further uh, you see here uh, if you expand this 3 to the power of 4 it, uh, 3 to the power of 4 means that we multiply this 3 on 4 times okay so when you multiply 3 then you see here 3 times of 3 becomes 9 and this 3 times of 3 becomes 9 and 9 nines are 81 so we see that 3 to the power of 4 is equals to 81 so now we replace this 3 to the power of 4 equals to uh, 81 and this is 3 minus 1 equals to 2 and this whole equals to 2 to the power of m okay so further uh, you see here uh, we have so if we multiply 81 by 2 uh, then you will get here 2 1 the 2 and 2 8 the 16 so you get 162 equals to 2 to the power of m so now in order to find the value of m here we need to take the log on both of the sides uh, so that here we take log so it will be written as log of 2 to the power of m is equals to log of 162 and after this step here we need to apply the property of logarithm so we know that log of a to the power of m is equals to m times of log a so here we apply this nice property of log in the left hand side of the above equation uh, so that uh, here uh, we move this m in the front of this log and it will be written as m times of log 2 is equals to log of 162 okay so uh, after this step here we move uh, this log 2 to the right hand side and it will be written as log of 162 divided by log of 2 so here uh, we need more simplification and now we write this 162 as in this form uh, we write it as 81 times of 2 becomes 162 and it is divided by log of 2 so here we apply another property of log in, in the numerator term we know that if you have log of a multiplied by b it is equals to log of a plus log of b so now we apply this nice property of log uh, in the numerator of this expression so it will be written as m equals um, log of 81 plus log of 2 divided by log of 2 okay so after this step here we write this 81 as in this form now we write 81 as 9 square plus log of 2 divided by log of 2 
so here we again use the property of log and we move this uh, uh, we move this two in the front of this log and it will be written as a two times of log nine uh, and plus uh, log of uh, 2 here we break this fraction and we write this log 2 separately on both of these terms so here we write this log 2 and uh, here you divide it by this log 2 and in the left hand side we have m and now in the next step here uh, we have m is equals to 2 times we write this 9 as 3 square and it is divided by log of 2 and here you see that this log 2 is cancelled out by this log 2 and we get here plus 1 and here we move this four, uh, this 2 in the front of this log and it will be written as 2 times of 2 becomes 4 log 3 divided by log of 2 and plus 1 okay so now here uh, we uh, need to uh, find the value of uh, log 2 and log 3 uh, so you see here the uh, value of uh, log 3 is equals to uh, 4 times of value of log 3 is 0 0.4771 and it is divided by uh, the value of log 2 so the value of log 2 is 0 0.4771 3010 and plus 1 so here we need more simplification and now we multiply this 4 by 0 0.4771 so when you multiply when you multiply this number by uh, this number then you get here 1.9084 divided by 0 0.3010 and plus 1 so here we need to subtract these two numbers so here we divide 1.9084 by 0 0.3010 okay 0 0.30 and 10 so you get here 6. Uh, 6.3401 and plus 1 so here when you add plus 1 here then uh, you will get here 7.3401 so this is the final value of m in this problem and now here we need to verify this value of m so is this value of m is satisfied over a given question statement or not okay so to check this we need to copy down the given question statement it is 3 to the power of 5 minus 3 to the power of 4 equal 2 to the power of m so here we need to substitute uh, the value of m in the right hand side and we know that 3 to the power of uh, uh, 5 uh, is directly equals to 243 and 3 to the power of 4 equals to 81 equals 2 to the power of 7.3401 so here you can use the calculator and you easily get uh, these values so when you subtract this value it will be equals to 162 the equals to this will be equals to uh, 162.02 so you can say that 162 is approximately equals to 162 so we say that the value of m is satisfied the given question statement and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos